Hi, this is Mitch from Swap Time, and we're gonna go over my LFX swap I'm gonna do in my 76 C10. Here's a crate uh, dropout engine I got from eBay. Came complete, serpentine system still all hooked up. Comes with the, the exhaust system, the cats, transmission, even the fuse box. The wiring harness is damaged, but I bought a brand new one, and I'm modifying that right now. It'll look a lot better with a brand new harness anyway. This is a 2015 LFX engine with a six-speed auto. It makes 323 horsepower. It did have a little bit of damage. I gotta replace a few of these cam sensors. So I need to order those today. And I'd like to take this intake and somehow smooth it and hydro dip it in carbon fiber. That's kind of a neat look to it. Now I'll show you the truck. And yeah, I'm at my work right now. Just installed an LS3 engine harness. But we do a lot of LS3s. But I modify these, these harnesses on my own on my off time. Keep very busy doing it. Comes out really clean. There's a Gen 5 engine, 6.2 with the 6 speed. This one is up and going, we're just doing the AC on it. So we have to pull the air intake to get clearance. That runs really strong. It's on 33s, I believe. And here's my truck. 76 Cheyenne, it's got two days ago off Craigslist. There's a little bit of a dent there, but I'm hoping I can pull it out. Pretty clean, very original. Pretty neat, it has the dealer tag on it still. Even has the owner's manual in the glove box still. Anything I'm doing to this can be completely reversible. I'm just doing this for fun. Uh, nothing's gonna be hacked. I'm not really gonna do any welding or modifying it too much. I'm just throwing a different engine transmission in it. It has supposedly a 350 in it with a turbo 350. Uh, it's missing it's missing pretty bad with two of the cylinders and it is getting spark and it is getting fuel so that's not good. But it starts right up Starts really good actually, better than most cars. Battery cables are junk. We 
got lots of room. Not that I need it for the V6. I don't know what they're doing up here. It's gross. Pretty cool truck. So hopefully I'll be able to get this running really nice and drive it a lot, which is my intended use. I'm not trying to make 600 horsepower. That's why I have it very reliable and drive as nice as possible. So we'll see how the LFX engine does. And if I don't like it, I'll put a Gen 4 5.3 in it or possibly a Gen 5. on base to start with. There's the owner's manual. Maybe it didn't come with trucks. This is 79. I thought the guy said this is a 76. Look at the title. Door panels are kind of shot. I like to make those look new again. Headliner is real bad. The seat and carpet are brand new. So let's need a dash pad. Maybe put some fresh vinyl dye on an instrument cluster bezel. Fix the door panel somehow. And do the headliner, and it'll look awesome in here. Someone put a bunch of crappy speakers in a long time ago. I'm gonna get rid of that. Well, let me know what you guys think of the project.